Hello and welcome to another Adobe Training Tip of the Month from your friends at Head Tricks Training. Today I'm in Adobe Photoshop Lightroom and I'm going to show you how to find missing photos if that should happen. So one thing in, in Lightroom that you should never do is move your images outside of Lightroom. So for example, I have this folder here called ATMK folder, Photos and those photos were imported from my desktop. If I go to my desktop, you'll see here it is, the ATMK photos with all of my photos inside. What would happen if I just randomly took this folder and dragged it into this random folder? Now I have no ATMK photos folder, but they're all inside of the random folder. If I go back into Lightroom, Lightroom's like, hey, question mark on the folder, which means these are all missing. Where are all these images? So if I see this little question mark, I can just right click or control and then press click on a Mac and I can choose find missing folder. It'll open to my computer. I can navigate to where those images are. Now they're in desktop and they're inside of this random folder. And then they're inside of ATM caves and there it is. And now you'll see that the images have been located. I'll do it again. I'll move them on the desktop once again. I'll take them outside of the random folder and move them to my desktop. I go back into Lightroom and Lightroom's like, hey, where are those images? Again, they're missing. And I right click, find missing folder. I can navigate to my desktop and I can show Lightroom where those images are. And here they are in the ATM Caves Photos folder. I press choose and the question mark goes away and all my images can now be viewed. So the moral of the story is if you're going to organize your images, once they're imported into Lightroom, only move them within Lightroom. I could add new folders here and inside of the ATM caves, I can add a new folder, right? New folder, but I'm adding it within Lightroom. So Lightroom can add the folder here on my desktop and it'll also add the new folder here within Lightroom. If I want to, I can come into here into my ATMK folder. And let's say I have a favorite image, this skull, and I'll drag it into the new folder. And now if I look at my desktop inside of the ATM caves folder, I now have a new folder, and inside that new folder is the image of the skull that I just moved. And there you go. I hope you enjoyed this tip of the month from Head Tricks Training.